Hello there and welcome back to The Legend of Matsuzuto Fall of the Conqueror. Last time we explored the drifts and found a few really interesting places. Uh, in between that episode and this one I actually did a little bit of exploration in the in the eastern drift. So I left the western drifts because I found absolutely nothing there and then came to the western ones and I found this place so I decided to start off the episode from from well where wherever it is that we are there's something interesting here red bakari okay that is very convenient so we finally found something in the drifts and it's a mask it's kind of scary though that one of the masks we absolutely have to find was in the drifts and I can tell that these drifts are a nightmare to travel through and navigate because first of all it costs money to use the flags and even when you have enough flags it's still such a nightmare to go through yeah I really don't like this area much We can only hope that, uh, and I'm also, yeah, I'm running out of flags, as you can see. I don't have any more red or blue flags. I didn't actually use any flags while searching these drifts before. So I only started now. And that's really worrying, because, yeah, we might actually run out of flags and then we'll be completely lost. Not the best planning on my part, to be honest, but I I would be just happy to find where we need to go. The whole Gapuha nest thing. Okay, we found something. Oh, this must be it. Yeah, this is probably the right place. I sincerely hope this is the right place. We have to be careful so we don't miss any masks if we come across them. Because some of them are mandatory to find. Yes, a safe spot. That is terrific. I'm pretty sure we're in the right place now. Yep, these are the Kapuha. We're gonna have to fight them eventually, so we're not gonna go into the battle right now right in the beginning. But really cool concept, I have to say. Like, bear-like Rahi that sometimes have Kahu in their backs. Okay, I wonder where it is that we need to go here. Oh! Hello, Luca. Luca? Rongsho isn't here, but Nakudo is. How about I help you out? Okay, so he's basically a shop for us. We are not going to buy anything from him. Let's see. It's a secret passage, but we need a key to get through. A key? Okay, well... We know another place to go to, so we're gonna go there. Well, it's kind of funny that Luca's idea of helping us to, is to become a shop, but uh, I guess it makes sense. But hopefully can we can go through this dungeon within this episode. Okay, what's with those Kapuha? Oh. They were sort of chasing us, but only for a while. Now let's see. Okay, there's uh we can swim there. And I think that's what we must do indeed. And we find Secret key? Oh, upgrade stone. Well, that's also good. We need to upgrade Gali's equipment. And here we... Oh. Okay, they're not quite chasing us now. Let's see what we can find from... Okay, we... Oh, wow. Three level ups. That's... that's really weird way to <laughs> to gain levels as I've already said before 
doesn't really make any sense. Okay, we press the switch and we'll probably be able to pull one of the other levers. Lots of rock in here. Okay, it's probably... Okay, it's probably up that we need to go next. This is also one of the weird... Gapuha. Okay. We have another switch pulled. This puzzle really doesn't take any... <laughs> well, any thought. Just... Oh, well. Just turning levers. Okay, this is probably one of those that has a Kahu on its back. So now we finally see what they look like. And that... Come to think of it, that really doesn't look like a Rahi. <laughs> it looked more like a mech or something like that. Okay. Alright, after this quite <laughs> dull puzzle, we find probably the secret key, I hope. Oh, Nakudo's key, yeah. That is good. So we'll be able to go where Luca was waiting for us. So I guess that's where we're headed. Okay, so we're finally back. Something really annoying happened while I was trying to get out of the place, which was that a Gapuha was actually blocking the way on the bridge, so I couldn't jump. Is that better work? Okay, dead. Anyway, there was a Kapuha on the other side of the bridge, meaning that I could not jump over it, and it wouldn't leave, so I had to basically do the whole puzzle thing again. But I also fought some Kapuha, so we're a bit higher level than last time. Hello, Toa. Still at it, I see. We're not quitting until you and your father give up this island paradise. It's not yours. There are many faithful citizens of Matanui that beg to differ. Clear show me one Matoran who works at with you. Well, it seems obvious that you Toa do not plan on leaving the island of Matanui. Fine, I welcome you to stay then. I hope you're prepared. Hey, where do you think you're going? Okay, we have some more Kapuha here. I saw quite a few of them while uh, doing the puzzle again. It was really annoying indeed. Okay, yes, I was starting to think if the cure water is not gonna work. <laughs> Still, this dungeon is not as bad as the, the spaceship was. That was pretty bad. <laughs> well, not bad, but quite long. Although I must admit that this place was harder to find. Gali is quite close to the Kapuha. Too close for comfort. As far as boss battles go, this is actually not that bad. I mean, it's just three of the basic enemies of this area. Granted, they've put up more of a fight than many of the other enemies so far, but still. Soon we're gonna have also this one taken care of. I hope we can actually find our way back to Kokoro because I didn't use the flags consistently in the drifts while trying to find this place. Okay, we need to see what's in that chest. It's probably a mask, I think. Received blue kakama. Yes. Okay, whoa. We got quickly. Alright, we're ready. Okay.
Okay, we don't have to go through the whole thing again. That's good. Hmm, golly. Excuse me? I was harsh. Anyway, I've decided that I will lend you my help. If you ever need it, just call on me. Hey, Kupaka has jumped. To the party menu. That's cool. Okay, let's see here. Yes, we have actually managed to deal with this area for good, I think. And we can finally return to... Now let's see if we can actually make it out of here. <laughs> that could turn out to be a bit problematic. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I am inferior. Had I not put the Kapuha on such a high esteem, the Kanohi Kakama would be in my hands now. I am powerful. Why couldn't I have sealed the chest with dark magic? No matter. It's just one mask. I have learned from this mis mistake. I will no longer personally send Merahi to do my bidding. The Toa Mata are powerful, more so than I had expected. Tasks concerning them are to be saved for the Dark Toa. I'll let them deal with everything. Oh, I am so grateful we did not have to go through the wastes again. Because that would have been painful. Okay, so I guess we need to talk to the to Raga now. I shall translate Nuch's words. The entire village is in your debt for what you've done. The fearsome ice Rahi have fled the village of Kokoro. Although Makuda still controls this icy region, I can rest peacefully knowing my people won't be killed by Kapuha. And if I'm correct, you found Kopaka and convinced him to join you on your quest. This is very good news, Toa. I look forward to hearing more of your accomplishments. Well, that's it then. Oh, okay, oh, it's the same. I guess we are going to leave Kokoro then. But before we do that, we should probably go to the inn. Because we need to heal up. Okay. Probably the next place we can go to is... Um, Onukoro, perhaps? Before we do that, let's save quickly. And leave this place. And we have to keep, a, keep out... Uh, we have to uh, keep our eyes out for the masks that we may find. Oh! Oh my! Do you see that? Wow, that's a long way. Oh, oh yeah, there's fire. This can't be good. Oh no, you're right. Something must be quick done. I really don't want to go in there. We have to. Volcanoes just don't suddenly become active with no earthly warning. We gotta quick find what's causing this. Indeed, we have to. Let's see, uh... We have the Kakama, so... We can go fast now. Uh, it was with... We need to push shift first. Okay, so now we have the Kakama. Yeah, this is gonna help us a lot. Uh, the back alley, and what is this? I don't know what this is. What is this? An upgrade stone. That's good news, of course, but... What is the back alley, though? What's the difference? Uh... Uh... Is this where we need to go? Or is it this? I really... 
Oh, we can actually move from here. Okay, so the back alley it is. Okay, uh, it's a bit difficult to navigate, but I do remember what we have to do. So we have to beat this Wahi. Which apparently is quite easy while, while we have elemental powers and stuff. And upgrade stones, a lot of them too. I think we're gonna switch up party a little bit. No, oh, we can do that. Okay, we have a reinforced bridge piece. Okay, let's see. Okay, we have the Kakama again. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's a switch over here. And a fight. With... I think these are supposed to be Ranima, but they look really strange, because they're not... They're standing on their own legs. Alright, so let's... Yes, we move the switch. And here we probably find some more... Pieces, yeah, bridge pieces. Okay, another one here. And maybe here also we'll find one? Or not? No, this is not a, this is a dead end. I wonder, oh, okay, there's one over here. And what's in this place? It's like a different section? Oh, no, 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 it's just a passageway. And we have a safe spot here. Let's see, okay. Yes, we have all the pieces we need. And a mask. That's good news. Received white cow cow. Okay, so it's a it's a Kupakas mask. Go around. Oh, <laughs> okay. <sighs> Yali, are you well okay? I'm fine. We have to save Takoro. Okay, so Kofo Yaga. Yeah, that was easy. <laughs> Okay, we win. That light enhancer must have been what almost caused the volcanic eruption. We better quickly. We should get out of here. Yes, that sounds like a plan. Okay, and now we probably... Oh. Oh, it's Rakshi. Goodness, who's that guy? Let's... We should probably use the Kakama to follow. Okay, let's follow him. Hey, Rakshi! Wait, I, I think I saw a mask? Oh, it is a mask. We received the White How, so Kopaka's mask again. Why are all his masks in? Weird that his masks are in Tawai. Okay, I wonder if this is where we... Oh. Oh, we're actually faster than it. <laughs> That's kind of hilarious. He went east. Oh, there's an Usul here. That's kind of cool. Kind of unexpected as well. Oh, we captured an Usul crab. Yeah, I think this is connected to something that you can do in Onukoro. You can like capture Usuls and do things with them. Uh, received mysterious note. Pressed 5 to stop riding the Ossal Crab. We're actually riding the Ossal Crab, that's amazing. Unfortunately, it also makes us slow. Which is kind of counterproductive. It's not really what you would expect. Uh... Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna send it to Onukoro, actually. We're gonna find out later what we can actually do with it. But 
for now we should try to find the the rock sheet. It's probably going to Gakoro. Luckily we can go quite fast. Oh, what is this? I can't understand this. It's written in an odd language. Well, there's an evil rock sheet on the loose, but I don't think that's a problem. We, we can still stop by and read some notes. Hmm, let's see what this tablet says. The plea of the Rahi, the cries in Gawahi, ring through the ears of those with protective careers. Their pay is ingratitude, fueled by nothing short of attitude. The Toa mu must help stop what hurts us, hunters that live to be vicious. They call themselves the minions, their slaves roam the by the dozens. They chase and hurt our kind, leaving nothing but carcasses behind. Toa, save our Rahi species, stop the dark Makuda's armies. Your people shall be rewarded with an artifact our kind have guarded. The sentient Gapuha. <laughs> what is that? Gapuha? What? I don't get it. Why do they want it? What do they want us to do? Besides what we're already doing. We don't even know how to free the Gapuha. What was that? Uh... It means we do all the ask. Okay, I think this is a side quest thing. Kind of a random timing since we're following that Rakshi guy and logically he's probably long gone by now, but... I guess that's not a reason to hesitate to kill Nuilaka in between. Well, this is certainly interesting. I mean, it's probably something uh, we need to do on the side. Maybe if we can sort of free the Kapuha, we will get a reward for that. But it's hard to say. Still, it's really cool that we actually got to use the Rao that we found in the drifts. And this guy is tough. Of course, I mean, he's tougher than the last time we fought him, which is back in the Nuijaga nest in Gaiwahi. But I wonder if the Rakshi we were following actually went to Ga Koro. That would make sense. So I guess that's where we're gonna go after this, unless we get some more clues. This is definitely a good experience for the, for the characters. Maybe gain some levels. Wow, he's just taking hits like such a tank. Okay, finally. <laughs> I was starting to wonder. And this shouldn't be too tough because the Kapuha we already went, went uh, against them, so. And as you can see, Onua is using like dark skills. He was sort of an upgrade. That we got. Okay, so we win. That's good. Ah, oh, this cannot be. Something has happened. Mm. Found blue and black Komau. Oh, that's interesting. He used his air powers to fly away before we could finish him. Maybe next time. Uh, where the heck are we? The two of us are not so different, if you ask me. I just wish I were an out as outspoken as you. Woo, I'm just a little bit hyper, Toa of Water. I want to finish this journey quest and end the reign of the Toa villains. Interesting, the Kapuha are slaves, as are the Frostalus. But they're not slaves of Makuda. Nuilaka's our best bet. But Nuilaka is one of the strongest minions, and he is a coward, like me. That was unexpected. Well, let's see if we can spot the Toa here. Um. Oh yeah, we need to switch to the Kanohi Kakama. I just really want to know what happened to the Rakshi. Uh, is 
this? Oh, an aquatic ocelot crab. That's random. We are running out of time, but I really need to know where the Rakshi went. Uh, it's really hard to go with this. Oh, come on. Move, Matoran. Maybe she has something to... Oh, still the same thing. Well, we're gonna find the Rakshi next time, so... Yeah, we're gonna save that for the next episode. But there was definitely some interesting developments in this one. And we are really getting somewhere with this game, which is really cool. But next time, we're gonna see if we can find the Rakshi and where he was going. Until then, see you guys next time.